Hey everyone, welcome back again to another Flutter tutorial and in this session we will discuss about how to create a local or internal package that can be used within the same project. Say for example if you want to share a code or if you want to reuse the same kind of code snippet in multiple places within the same project then you can go for creating a package for that. By creating a package is not just you but anyone who is contributing the same project can make use of that package and get the job done. In this video, we will be discussing about how to create one such package that can be used within the same project. Alright, so without wasting time, let's at least jump into the coding part and get this done. Well, starting with the main.dat file, we have a navigation to my homepage. And inside the my homepage, we have nothing much but a set of container and some text widget. So you can see here the text is wrapped inside a container having some kind of border radius and the default blue color. Okay. Now we want to create a package for this. Though it is going to be a very simple one, we are going to create a package for this just for the understanding purposes. Okay. We are going to create a package that is going to deal with the same kind of containers and the colors. In short, our package final result would be looking something like we can remove this now. Let me give a sample package name and it is going to accept a child which is a, any kind of a flutter widget okay right therefore this is how our final result is going to look like we have the package name this is going to be our package so for now i have given a dummy name and the package will accept the child that can wrap any flutter widget okay and you are going to get the same kind of desired result that is what we want to achieve Okay, so this is how the code would look like uh, finally after importing that package inside our project. Okay, and before that, let's jump into the package creation. Let us think of a way of achieving the same kind of thing by creating a separate dart file. Okay, so for that, now we can move over to the folders and let me create a package here not a package but a dart file with the name package. Sorry. And let me copy paste the thing here. You can create a stateless widget class and name it as colored container. This is not the package creation, but just to have a previous idea of how it is going to look like. By doing this, you will be able to better understand of how we can create packages. Right now, we can create a final widget, which is the child, which is going to accept the child, and we can optionally have the colors. Right, we can add them and say the constructors. Right, uh, here instead of default color, you can specify the container color. If it is null, you can have it as blue. And similarly, instead of this default text, you can pass it as the child. Okay, yeah. Now you can use this colored container class over here. And have the child first let us import that and we can have a child for that and the child is going to be the same text widget all right so we try to have the same kind of functionality but we just um, remove that code from here and placed it inside the separate file so this is how this is the code which we are going to have inside our package okay so just for that understanding purpose i have just made that inside a separate dart class but it is not something which is focusing on package creation okay so now let us dive into creating a package inside this project for doing so you can move over to the project root directory and you can create a package folder here okay and for creating a package in Flutter, you can make use of the command which is flutter create double hyphen template equal to package 
followed by the package name the package name is going to be colored container okay hit enter you can see that under the folder package you will be able to see the lib uh, same kind of lib folder but instead of main you have this colored container the dart file which is having some kind of default uh, code snippet but you can remove that now okay and you can have the same kind of uh, so we can copy paste this code snippet right from here to the packages where is it yeah but you can have that you can do in that way or else if you want to have a better folder structure you can create another folder called src inside the lib and have a separate file called rendering dot dot and place it over there okay and you need to make use of part of colored container because that is uh, the parent file and inside this colored container you can make use of path src specify the relative path of where the source code is uh, written okay and also import the material dot which will automatically import and say that parent class okay now we have created uh, a package uh, and also have written the logic over here now in order to access this package from the root directory or the root project you need to go to the root folders perspective.oml file and inside that just like adding dependencies for other packages you need to uh, specify the same but with the different syntax that is you can you need to pass in the package name which is colored container in our case and specify the path that is the relative path where the package is okay packages slash colored container so can you spell get yeah now uh, everything is almost done you can now move to the projects root project and inside the screen now we can delete this package the dart file and you can also remove the import now if you make use of the quick fix you'll be able to see that import as packages as colored container this is something which is imported directly from the internal package okay So in order to cross check you can go over you can click this it is going to take you directly to the internal package uh, dot file okay if you rerun the app it is going to have the same kind of result so it is actually uh, imported as the internal package you can see that the package prefix over here so this is how you can actually create an internal package for your Flutter project you can also try it out by yourself this is that much easy and just a quick overview for creating a package we just need to make use of the uh, command which is flutter create double hyphen template equal to package followed by the package name which will create a package inside your project root directory and inside the package you can make use of on the part and parts of if you are going to have a folder structure just like what we have right over here say the source code you need to have the part of which is going to specify the package name and you say the color content that is the root dot file you need to have the part which specifies the relative path of the uh, file all right this is all about inside the package which we need to do moving over to pubspec.oml you need to specify the package right over here and as in the same kind of relative path after doing that you can move over to the root project and import that widget as a package
okay so that's it guys that's all about how you can create a uh, internal package for your flutter app hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do so consider subscribing and i will see you in the next one bye